Hi everyone, welcome to Enphase. Today we are here at one of our IQ battery sites to walk you through an Enphase energy system installation. This system includes the IQ battery 5P, the IQ system controller and IQ at series microinverters installed under each solar panel. The Enphase energy system starts at the roof with panels and microinverters and continues through the wire down to the IQ system controller and IQ batteries. Before diving into the wiring, let's quickly cover the basics of installing Enphase microinverters over the rooftop. For this setup, we are using Enphase IQ8P microinverters. These are mounted under each solar panel and connected using Enphase IQ cables. Each branch circuit should not include no more than 7 IQ8P microinverters or no more than 9 IQ8HC microinverters. This keeps the current within the 20 ampere branch circuit limit. Make sure microinverters are spaced evenly and within reach of the AC connectors on the IQ cable. Mount them using the slots on the mounting frame. Ensure the frame faces the sky. Use nuts, bolts, plane and spring washer to secure them. Spread out the IQ cable and connect it to all microinverters. Cut the cable according to your layout and seal the open end using the IQ cable terminator. Do not unscrew the terminator cap once tightened, otherwise it will get damaged. To extend the IQ cable, use a terminal block inside a weatherproof enclosure. Avoid insulation tape or MC4 connectors for AC extension. Now let's move towards IQ system controller mounting. Choose a solid vertical surface close to the main electrical panel. Ensure it is protected from direct sunlight and water. Mount the controller 1000 mm from the ground and maintain minimum 150 mm clearance from other sides. IQ system control package includes IQ system controller, system shutdown switch, wiring kit with controller connector and register, mobile connect cell modem, quick installation guide. When mounting to a wall, place the IQ system controller on the wall. Mark the top and bottom holes. Keep controller aside and drill holes in the wall. Use washers and suitable fasteners to mount the system controller on the wall. Use a level gauge to align the IQ system controller and closer horizontally. Ensure it is leveled and supported. Refer to the QIG before installation. Now see the mounting of IQ battery 5P. Install the battery on a flat, stable and well ventilated surface away from direct sunlight and water. The battery weights 82 kgs. Ensure the wall can support it. IQ battery box includes IQ battery 5P, ID cover and two conduits cover, mounting bracket and protective shield, wall drill template, screws, anchor clips, control connector and resistor. Apart from this, Belcom make control cable to be purchased separately from Enphase distributor. Do not use any other communication cable. Mount the battery at least 150mm from ground and 300mm from all other sides. Paste the template, drill the holes and secure the bracket with the help of fasteners. Refer the quick installation guide before you start. Lift and hook the battery onto the bracket. Secure the battery by inserting the anchor clips. If you are installing multiple batteries, connect them in a daisy chain or parallel manner. Open the wiring cover. Carefully remove the button connector from its terminal. Connect the line and neutral cables. Each battery draws up to 16 ampere. Make sure you choose the cable size accordingly. Connect the earthing cable. Connect the control cable with connector. Plug it into control communication board. Ground the drain wire. Plug the end resistor into the last battery. After completion of wire, tie all wires. Plug in positive and negative DC connectors. Connect the power button and install the battery wiring cover and tighten the screws. Do not press the battery button until system controller connections are complete. Now let's move on to the IQ system controller wiring. 
केबल्स में एंटर फ्रॉम लेफ्ट राइट बैक और बॉटम आई सिस्टम कंट्रोलर कम्स विथ प्री इंस्टॉल्ड आई गेट पे आई क्यू रिले प्रोडक्शन एंड कंजम्पन सिटीज इट हैज डेडिकेटेड टर्मिनल्स फॉर कनेक्टिंग ग्रिड पी वी बैटरी बैकअप एंड नॉन बैकअप लोड्स इट ऑल्सो सपोर्ट्स बोथ सिंगल एंड थ्री फेज नॉन बैकअप लोड्स अप टू सिक्सटी थ्री एम पेयर पर फेज ओनली सिंगल फेज लोड्स कैन बी बैकड अप अप टू सिक्सटी थ्री एम पेयर रेफर आई क्यू सिस्टम कंट्रोलर क्विक इंस्ट्रक्शन गाइड फॉर मोर डिटेल्स आई क्यू सिस्टम कंट्रोलर सपोर्ट्स बोथ सिंगल फेज एंड थ्री फेज ग्रिड इनपुट कनेक्ट ग्रिड इनपुट आर वाई बी एंड न्यूट्रल टू ग्रिड इन टर्मिनल्स एल वन एल टू एल थ्री एंड न्यूट्रल यूज अप्रोप्रिएट केबल साइज एज पर हाउस लोड फॉर नॉन बैकअप कनेक्शन रन अ सर्किट फ्रॉम नॉन बैकअप पैनल टू नॉन बैकअप लोड्स टर्मिनल आई क्यू सिस्टम कंट्रोल सपोर्ट्स ऑल सिंगल एंड थ्री फेज लोड्स मैक्मम सिक्सटी थ्री एम पेयर पर फेज यूज सेपरेट डेडिकेटेड लाइन्स एंड न्यूट्रल वायर्स फॉर नॉन बैकअप लोड्स फॉर बैकअप कनेक्शन रन अ सर्किट फ्राम बैकअप पैनल टू बैकअप लोड्स टर्मिनल्स only single phase loads can be backed up maximum up to 63 ampere use separate dedicated line and neutral wire for backup loads connect ac output from battery to dedicated battery terminals via mcb line to l1 neutral to neutral bus bar connect the earthing wire to earth bus bar route ac solar output to pv in terminals via mcb current must not exceed 63 ampere per phase use a 4 core 0.5 square mm cable for system shutdown switch connection mount system shutdown switch at an accessible location for connection refer the iq system controller quick installation guide inside iq system controller connect the control cable with connector plug into system shutdown switch terminals connect the control cable with connector coming from iq battery plug into control communication terminal ground the drain wire now wiring for iq system controller is completed after wiring completion plug in the cell modem with iq gateway usb port and close the dead front tighten all the screws mount the system controller door put the battery's id cover put conduit cover secure the battery iq cover with screws provided before turning on the mcbs make sure grid voltages are within range use a digital multimeter to verify voltage turn on the grid supply and load breakers wait for system to boot you will hear relay clicks turn on pv battery and iq gateway mcb once battery mcb is on the led flashes green once and switches off after 15 to 20 seconds it will starts flashing in a red triple flash pattern press the dc control switch on the battery and then wait until the led starts flashing yellow system is now ready for commissioning use the n phase installer app and follow the workflow Always follow safety guidelines and refer to the Enfish installation manual for more details. Thank you for watching.